Well, hello everyone. It's your lovely host here. Once again, it is Team Rai. Now, everyone, who's seen the very first video of the day? If not, check it out. It's a very good one, in my opinion. And don't worry, I'll discuss my social media accounts after this part of the video is over. Now, switch your sit back, relax, put your feet up, grab some meat, or grab something to drink, or maybe, just maybe, you want to chill like a villain and hear my thoughts, my opinions, and the subject. And of course, the link will be down below, or the article will be down below. Now, this video will be strictly an article. First, of all is, in your opinion only, is Ken Shamrock a future W Hall of Famer? In your opinion only. Okay, now the thing is, will we ever see Ken Shamrock back in the W Square Circle in some capacity? Yes or no? Let me know down below. Okay, speaking of Ken Shamrock again, Ken Shamrock made an appearance on the 10 count discuss a world range of topics during it shamrock explained why the montreal screw job at sarasri 97 led to him not trusting um certain people in the WWE. what's your thoughts on that issue the match between Shawn michaels and brahart and then early to give the win to Michaels, who had Hart in a sharpshooter and get the WWE title off of him, off of Hart, sorry, who was leaving for WCW. Now, if you were McMahon, how would you do things better without the screw job getting involved? How would you do a better job? Of course, that is the most, mo most famous thing what happened in the uh, back in the day i wish that never happened i'm s serious i really wish that brahart never left the f and went to wcw you know i wish things worked out between brahart and vince but mcmahon don't want him to, to leave as a champion and go to wcw you know, I think McMahon should just give him more money because he was on fire when he was champion. And they, that was a, a bad decision, in my opinion. The whole screwdriver should never happen. Now, Triple H and Shawn Michaels says he had nothing to do with it. I think so, yeah. That's bull crap. Of course they did. The referee did. Everyone knew except Bret Hart. Even, of course, Vince knew about it. There's so many different versions of this storytelling is crazy. Even uh, the DV called um, Behind the Shadows or something like that. I used to have it. I don't know what happened to it. So I probably lost it when I was when I was moving a couple years ago. So that is a bummer. And it took forever. That Bret Hart gets back in the WWE. You know, patch things up with with Shawn Michaels, and then he, he had a face-off with with uh, Vince. Excuse me. And then eventually, the, the led up to a match between those two guys at WrestleMania 26. I was there, and I thought it would be a good, good match, but no, it was not that great. McMahon is so flipping old. Bret Hart even older because it's that match was not that great. And of course, the Hart family got to get involved, make it more entertaining. And it was not that great, in my opinion, once again. So, now do you agree that Screwjob for W for Survivor Series 97 should never happen? Or do you think it should have happened? Are you glad it happened? Probably none of you wanted it to happen, but it did happen. So, um, as a major shocking value back in the day. And of course, they want to like, redo it back in what point break between CM Punk and, uh, and um, Taker. Remember that one? Of course, it would never be as good as the original screw job, but the original screw job should never happen, like I said. So, the um, WWE McMahon should have a better idea of. It should be like a disqualification, something like that. Bret Hart, 
still become champ, still reigning main champion. But the next night on Raw, before he head out or however, he should just drop it, you know. But that was a terrible booking, in my opinion. I don't know how would you book that match because Bret Hart, I think, is gonna leave the next night and go to WCW. I don't know. And his WCW run was not that great. Do you think it was or not? Have a good one now. Follow me on Instagram, Twitch, Twitter, TikTok, all my social media accounts will be down below. If you want to be part of the show, that's fine. And if not, then don't worry about it. See you guys tomorrow. Enjoy the rest of your Thursday. Later.